Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So guys, today I'll be doing a wig install as well as like a wig review for y'all. And guys, this hair was sent to me by Love Me Hair and I have done quite a few reviews for them in the past maybe like most recent past i've been doing quite a few reviews for love me hair so yeah you can check those videos out too and if you're new to my channel my name is crown k thank you so much for stopping by i really do hope that you stick around and to my returning subscribers thank you guys for always like rocking with me so yeah we're just gonna jump straight into the video like um usually i come on here my makeup isn't done or nothing but we're really just gonna go straight into the video um i really much rather like coming on and doing my wig without having my makeup done but i already have my makeup done for something else so we're just gonna go straight into it so what i'll do is like try like wiping the area off that has the makeup on my forehead and then just like doing the whole wig install and guys it's raining outside i don't know if y'all are hearing it because um my new like mic it picks up everything so hopefully y'all not really like hearing that but guys this is what the package um looks like the love me here package it's pretty cute and it's a pretty like sturdy package if i can get it open and inside inside the packaging guys it the hair comes in this and wow you get a ziploc bag with like some hair essentials it has some of these little combs little hairpins sorry it comes with a comb um elastic bad tweezers tweezers hair clips the elastic band the rat tail comb as well as a scarf to tie your hair down so it really does give you quite a bit of like free goodies and guys this wig that they sent me it's a wig that you can do like two different looks with it so i'm gonna show you what the wig look looks like and then i'm gonna show you the extra um hair that came in the bag that converts the wig into like a highlighted wig so this is the wig it has um i don't know what color this is to be honest with you but it has it has this color this is like auburn i don't know but it has this color i didn't think it was gonna be this color but yeah this is the color of the wig but we gonna we gonna make it work um the wig comes with a strap already sewn in it has adjustable straps in the the inside a comb at the top one in the bottom and i think it ha and it has combs on the side so this wig does carry combs adjustable straps plus a elastic band sewn in it already comes parted like down the center i don't know if i'll keep the center part but i'm gonna actually like install the wig and then the side the lace uh, i don't know what color this is but i'm gonna put makeup and we're gonna fix that we're definitely gonna fix that but it does come parted already and i feel like this is a 13 by 4 because yeah i feel like this is a this is about right for a 13 by 4. i really don't know what color this is guys the color is kind of like throwing me but i'm gonna um go through and install the wig and then we'll see what we look like um the hair does come with these clippings that you can use to add highlights to the hair so let me like get the hair done first and let's see so i did a put foundation on the lace off camera and i also added foundation to the wig cap so guys i cleaned my forehead off with some alcohol and i'm going in with the got to be gel just like one layer and then i'm using the got to be free spray and then i'm going on my blow dryer on cool just to get that a bit tacky and then i'm going to be applying the 
wig and guys this wig needed some work like the frontal was a little bit like dense it wasn't like plucked or anything so i had to go in and pluck it and after like getting the hair on like the whole frontal like on i went in and then i just parted out like some of the hair to use as the baby hairs and then i started like plucking away some more after like cutting down the edges oh, after like trimming down the edges to make the baby hairs i went in and i plucked some more this frontal does take some work if you want to just like take it out of package and put it on you're gonna have a very dense looking frontal so i do suggest like plucking it and yeah i went in and i plucked it i didn't i don't pluck in like any particular way i just try to pluck like as much as behind the hairline as possible and i did go in with an eyebrow razor and i trimmed the edges and i just like played around with it until it worked somewhat and i went ahead and i went off camera and i did the other side because i really needed to like focus and i really needed to like be up in the mirror so that's what i got after i tried plucking it off camera and i'm just tying that down and letting it set for a bit Now that the frontal is on guys I'm gonna go in and use my curling wand just to like flatten the part a bit I didn't plug my hot comb in I just decided to use the curling wand today so that's what I used and guys I don't think this frontal is pre-plugged like I really don't I had to do a lot of work and love me hair usually has like a lot of like pre-plugged frontal that's just like ready to go but this one was a little bit more work and guys I decided on doing a style so I went in and I just parted like a square section at the top and yeah once I got that situated I'm just gonna put that in a rubber band and I also parted out some little like tendrils at the front so I'm going to do two of those. I was going to do like a whole rubber band hairstyle where I did like multiple like rubber bands but then I just couldn't be bothered so I just did like this little cute style. I'm adding some mousse on the hair just to hold it and then I'm just getting that in with a rubber band and then I did go in again and tweeze a bit more of the hair just to get it to be more realistic in the front. And I'll go in with my curling wand to curl the tendril area of the style. And I'll do the same thing on the other side until our hairstyle is like completed. This hairstyle is like pretty simple and it's so cute. So if you get your frontal, you can like do this with your wig. You don't necessarily have to like wear it down. You can like experiment and like, you know, do, do this little cute style. I feel like everybody can do this style. It's super easy. And guys, I'm gonna go in with my curling wand and I'll just curl the rest of the hair so everything like goes together. And that's basically it for styling after curling with my curling wand. It's pretty simple. I didn't do anything out of the ordinary. So like y'all can achieve this exact like hairstyle. And guys, all the links will be down in the description bar with the information on this hair. So if you're interested in purchasing this unit, then you can definitely do that.
and if you've gotten to this far in the video like be sure to give this a video a thumbs up be sure to comment and most importantly like subscribe to my channel and guys this is um these pieces are the highlighted pieces that came in the box this allows you to switch the hair up in less than a minute so i'm gonna go in and i'm gonna just like stick these highlighted piece pieces within the hair and give the style like a different look like let me know down below what you preferred the hair with the highlights or without the highlights and the highlights the highlighted pieces come as clip-ins so you literally just like part your hair clip the section in snap the clip in and that's it you've transformed the wig so it's one wig with two different ways of wearing it so you know you have different styling options the highlights look really good let me know down below guys like which one was your favorite remember to leave me a comment and guys subscribe 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 thank you guys so much for tuning into another one of my videos i really appreciate you guys and i really love you guys oh so much i'll catch you guys in my next one